In this video, I will be showing you how you can use your Google Forms uh, to have multiple forms feed information into one single spreadsheet. Uh, there are times where, like here, I'll have a couple different quizzes for like my reading block, and I'd like all of that data and information for my students just to automatically populate into one spreadsheet instead of having multiple spreadsheets based off of each form. So here I already have my my reading quiz ready for my students. Uh, I've enabled uh, restricted my users. I've enabled the make this a quiz and you can also turn on uh, the lock mode for Chromebooks which is a really nice feature um, to have. So I am now ready to start receiving responses and, and have that for to go into a spreadsheet. So I'll select this option where it says responses and I want to come here to where it says create spreadsheet. Here it's going to say create a new spreadsheet and you can go ahead and rename it. Since I'm going to have all of my reading quizzes that I'm going to be using throughout the year, I want it to go on one spreadsheet. So I'm just going to go and title it reading quiz data and it will create. Okay. And then here it'll go ahead and create it and then it'll save it automatically into whatever folder you are in where you're creating that form. So I already have my quiz for my reading, my multiple reading quizzes that I have. So all of my information data will be going into one location. So let me show you how this works. So I can go to my, my preview and then I can go ahead and start submitting information and show you how this works. And select there, which two sentences, I'll need to select two. I'm done. Let's go and do another one. For Frank. Okay. And then here it'll automatically populate that in your spreadsheet. Since this was quiz one, you can go ahead and rename the tab down here. To do that, you'll just select the drop down and you can rename it to have it fit for whichever quiz or form that you were wanting to do. Okay, so that was my quiz one. Now, later on in the year, we are ready for quiz two. So I want to go ahead and select where it says responses and go ahead and select the create spreadsheet. Instead of creating a new spreadsheet, you want to go ahead and select an existing one. Go ahead and select that and click select. And then here, it'll open up uh, It already choose where you already have some certain spreadsheets. So here's my reading quiz data that I want it to go to. Now what will happen is it'll go ahead and create an additional tab on the bottom for you once this boots up. So here's quiz one. Then you can go ahead and slide it to whichever order that, that you would like it to be in as well. And then I want to go ahead and rename the bottom of, of this form to match it with my quiz name. So we'll call this one quiz two. And then we'll go ahead and submit some answers for this quiz. Which two sentences? Boom. We'll do another response. Response. For Justin. And there we go. So now we'll go to our spreadsheet in a second, and now it'll automatically populate. And you can see here, since I already had it self grading, I have all that information right here. So in the same spreadsheet, you can auto-populate multiple quizzes that will feed into one spreadsheet. Hope this tutorial helped you.